Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a bank account in your QuickBooks Pro company. Okay. So the first thing, open your QuickBooks Pro and then you will have your company name listed such as this. Now click on open button and it will open your company account. It will take some time depending on your RAM and amount of time it takes for processing all the data. The more data it has, the more time it will take for loading all the elements. Now you will find us in home page, you have this chart of accounts. Okay, so here what we are going to do is we are simply going to click on this chart of accounts on a right hand side you have this company widget in which you can see the chart of accounts now here you will find a list of accounts here expenses income and then cost of goods sold okay this is where you're going to add your bank account so look at the bottom screen and here you see account so simply click on that drop up menu and here you find a new option control N you can edit or delete existing entries you can make particular account inactive okay so in order to create bank account I want you to click on this new option the short key for that is control N and you can make this inside chart of account okay so there are also options for going through this your company homepage then you can go through creating a new account through chart of account okay so once you are here you will find that it asks you whether to create income account or expense so we are going to create bank account so we choose this option bank okay now click on continue and then you have account name so here you can specify your bank name let's say I have account in Kotak Mahindra Bank limited you can have any other standard chartered HSBC IDFC or any other bank here you can provide the description for this account in my case it is current account okay LLB then you can add bank account number if you are tracking multiple bank accounts then it helps to have a number listed then you have routing number so if you're going to make use of payroll facility then you can make use of setting up that bank account through this routing okay you can use starting balance and ending date here so statement ending balance and statement ending date so this ending balance ending date will be your current available balance within bank you can cancel this and now what you can do is you can click on save and close for just entering your single bank detail if you click on save and new you'll be able to add one more bank entry so if you have multiple banks choose save and new if you have single entry then you use save and close and here it asks you to set up a bank feed you can see that it will ask you to connect with specific online services for this account if it's available you'll be able to link it if not then simply click on no okay and now you can see that at the top of your chart of accounts you will find your bank name and you have type bank then balance is zero okay now the thing here is any entry that you add within your company account for debit and credit will be from the balance available so you can connect this bank account to your bank services or you can simply 
do the manual entry within your QuickBooks Pro. So this was a simple example on how to add bank account in your QuickBooks Pro.